cleanup procedures, and art class group jobs. There are three important steps at cleanup time. Number one is stop working and do your group job. Group jobs will be assigned at the beginning of each rotation that I see you for art class. Number two is help if needed. If you notice another job is falling behind and they need some help, please help them. And then number three, once you've completed all your cleanup, please wait at your seat or workspace. In order to do your cleanup efficiently, you will need to be put into groups. The groups will be determined how you are already seated in the classroom. And then clear frames will be placed near each of your groups to determine what small part you have in caring for your workspace and supplies. Listen carefully as I will explain each of the jobs. There are distributors and collectors. Distributors pass out supplies. Each person from your group should hand out something different. The reason why is because if you each hand out something different, it goes much quicker. And remember to prevent accidents by not carrying too much. And then there are collectors. Collectors are those that at cleanup time collect all supplies and put away. Remember, prevent accidents by not carrying too much. Table monitors and floor monitors. Table monitors, if needed, wipe and dry tables and desks and help collectors if needed. If you notice the collectors forgot a supply on a table or desk, please help them to put it away. Floor monitors, you are responsible for checking the floor for any drop supplies, pieces of paper, or any mess left behind. Noise monitors are responsible for monitoring the classroom noise level. If voice level gets too loud, you are to remove the letters E, S, and I. You start by removing the E, and then if we get too loud again, then the S, and then if you need the I. If we get to no, that means no talking. The letters can be placed in the special pouch designed just for them. Cart supply monitors organize visible student supplies on the cart that were used or need tidying. If you notice the art cart needs some attention in an area, please take a moment to tidy them up. The cart supply monitors are also responsible for making sure the items with early finisher activities are nice and tidy as well. So the modeling clay, puzzles, and Legos should be nice and neat on the cart. This way, Mrs. Studgery can fit as much as possible on her cart when she arrives for art class. Quality control monitors, if needed, double check and help other group jobs. They also will move the drying racks or Mrs. Studgery's cart or the red runner cart if needed to the next location. You are the teacher's assistants. You also might be taking things back to your storage cabinets in the music room as well. Paintbrush and bucket monitors will be responsible for rinsing and putting away paintbrushes emptying and stacking buckets, as well as emptying the used paint water bucket. Please see Mrs. Studgery for directions on how to handle this, as this procedure will change sometimes depending on the kind of paint and brushes you are using. Thank you in advance for doing your small part and helping to care for your workspace, supplies, and the art cart. Don't worry if you can't remember what all the jobs are. The descriptions will be on Mrs. Sedry's art cart as well as nearby in a clear frame. If you have trouble reading any of the words, please don't hesitate to ask for help from a neighbor or Mrs. Studry.